Meanwhile, hundreds of people lined up today for booster shots at Summit High School. Case rates in Summit County have been dropping lately, but the health department says it might not be as good of news as it sounds. Mountain Newsroom reporter Spencer Wilson joining us from Summit High School. And Spencer, they told you the data might not be telling the entire story here. Kelly, Summit County Health says that the amount of testing has actually dropped, partially because some people are going home for the holidays, partially because some of those testing sites are closed for the holidays. But either way, that doesn't give us as clear of a picture as it would were more people getting tested. But in the meantime, County Health says that they are impressed and excited about the number of people who are coming to get their booster shot today. Pfizer shots going in in hopes of a bit more protection. Right? Yeah, excited to have it. Wait till tomorrow. I know. See how we feel tomorrow. <laughs> right. That's the real teller. Cases in Summit County are actually starting to drop right now, but Summit County Health says it's been too much like a roller coaster lately to trust this is a sign of something bigger. And these folks say it's not something they're going to risk. You know, it's it's tough to say, you know, with uh yeah, Omicron, you know, just kind of ramping up. It's yeah, time will tell. So you know, I'm, I'd, I'd like to remain hopeful, but we'll see. 300 booster doses administered just today. They think they could have done more had they had more spots open. Yeah, so um, around Thanksgiving time or the week before Thanksgiving, we started to really see um, our clinics completely fill up. Lauren Gilbert says that's in part because of mandates from ski resorts and age groups becoming eligible for the booster, but says it's encouraging to see more people getting the shot either way. Right. I, I think we're hopeful, but we need to follow the science. County Health says that they do a clinic every Tuesday and Thursday, but after the success of this Sunday clinic as well, they're hoping to do one later in January on a day that people might be able to get free easier. Live in Summit County, Spencer Wilson covering Colorado for.